while a house fire in Greenfield is now being described as suspicious by investigators. Brandon Rook is live on South 46th Street with an update and some new video. Brandon. George and Carol, we talked to a neighbor who provided us that video. Just take a look at the front of the house right now. You can see fire recovery workers patching things up, and it appears that gasoline was used to start the fire by a man living here. And this is cell phone video caught by a neighbor showing Greenfield firefighters fighting flames. Everything is gone and investigators are still at the home a day later. It was very, very surprising. This all stems from what Greenfield police say was a disagreement between people living in the house. They say a 26 year old man admitted to police he set his basement on fire. I can't fathom anybody setting your dwelling on fire. <laughs> would not have any idea what, why someone would think that's a good idea. It's grew quicker than he expected, and he had to hurry up and get himself and other residents out of the house before it got fully engulfed. Witnesses say when police arrived, the man was standing in front of the home, watching his home burn with a drink and suitcase in his hands. Firefighters came across a suspicious device and the Milwaukee bomb squad was called. Neighbors had to be evacuated. I'm just glad that uh, no other houses got involved and no one got hurt. The device turned out to be a false alarm. The 26 year old suspect is facing arson and recklessly endangering safety charges. We hope the best for them. Well, we, we hope the best as well for the perpetrator that he gets the help that he needs. A woman and a young child were inside of the home at the time of the fire. They were able to get out safely and this fire is still under investigation and we promise to keep you updated with the latest once we get more details. In Greenfield, Brandon Rook, today's TMJ4. It could have been a lot more devastating. Thank you very much, Brandon.